In this card game, compete with others to be the first to check off the mean, median, mode, and range. This game is suitable for players in grades 6 through 8. You need a deck of UNO cards, remove all non-numeric cards in the deck, such as the skip, reverse, wild, etc. Additionally, you will need the Statsy score sheet. During each round, players try to collect cards for which the mean, median, mode, or range is equal to the target number. The game has four rounds. Players must make a hand for each type of statistic during the game. No statistic can be repeated. The first dealer is the player with the longest first name. The dealer deals seven cards to each player, placing the remaining cards in a pile in the middle of the playing surface and flip the top card face up next to the deck to create a discard pile. The dealer flips up the top card of the deck to determine the target card for the round. Play starts with the player to the left of the dealer. Here are the rules. We will be modeling these rules in the next few scenes. Take a moment to pause the video to read them. On your turn, pick up a card from the deck or the discard pile. Then discard a card from your hand that you do not need. If you are not able to lay down a hand in which the mean, median, mode, or range matches the target number, discard to end your turn. If you determine that your hand satisfies the target mean, median, mode, or range, lay down your cards face up in front of you. Remember, you must use all of your cards. As you can see, the player's cards at the top right of the screen have a mean equal to 5. Write your score on your scorecard to identify that you have completed that round. You have now completed one of the statistics. You cannot repeat it on the following rounds. When a player lays down a hand, the player must state the statistic the hand satisfies and answer any questions other players might have regarding how the player knows the hand is correct. The rest of the players have one more chance to try to find either the mean, median, mode, or range. After the other players have had a final chance, a new round begins. If you were able to lay down your seven cards in a round, Pick up seven new cards. Flip up the top card of the deck. This number is the new target number for the round. All other players keep the hand from the previous round. All players change their goal to the new target number. To win the game, be the first player to check off the mean, median, mode, and range on your scorecard. Here are some questions to think about. What are strategies you used to complete your checklist? Which of the statistics was the most challenging to get? There are many variations to this game. One variation is to play with more or fewer cards. To play this game, deal an even number of cards so that the median is no longer the middle card. This increases the challenge of the game. Another variation is to play collaboratively. In this game, players lay their cards face up on the table so they can work together to complete the statistics score sheet checklist. Finally, you can play this game with dice. When playing with dice, play similarly to Yahtzee. Roll a die to determine the target number. Roll the five dice or some subset of the dice at most three times in order to get the numbers necessary for your target number. Use this statistic scoring sheet for this variation too. I hope you enjoy playing Statsy. Find more thorough instructions by copying the instructions link to the Regional Math Science Center website to read the game rules or just re-watch this video, pausing as needed. Thanks for playing.